Welcome to the board game fiesta We'll tell you about the latest game that we have found You'll love it! You want to know what happens when somebody who's only background in gaming is Parcheesi and Dominoes and then they play one of my games? Let's find out. We're talking about zombie dice, the Steve Jackson classic. It's very easy to play. It's ready to go right. You just pop the lid and you're ready to play. There's no setup, nothing to do. You just start playing. That's what makes it great. You're going to love this. You take, shake it up. You take three dice out and you roll them. Boom. There's three sides on the dice. The brain. The shotgun blast. And the footsteps. Okay. If you get a brain on the dice, that's what you want. You set it aside. 13 brains wins the game. That's what you're looking to get. 13. If you get a shotgun blast, the guy shot you. Okay. If you get three of those, your turn's over. And if you get the footsteps, you say, if you want to keep going, you set that aside and draw a couple more out. Always three at a time. You roll again. You get a brain, you set it here. You get a blast, you set it here. Now you got to ask yourself, do you want to keep going? Because you get three shotgun blasts, it's all over. Okay? So if I stop here, I take two brains, write down two, and that's it. Uh, my turn's over, and I pass the dice, put them back in the cup, pass it to the next player. They go. Okay? That's all there is to it. And we're going to try around right now, and let's see how it works out. That's right. Here we go. There's three dice out. Three. Here we go. Boom. That's wow. Now the red dice are, are uh, tough. They're the toughest. The yellow, medium toughness, and the green ones are easy. So I'm going to keep going. I got two brains here and, and a footstep. Here we go. Boom. Wow. Three more brains. That's four. That's three. Uh, five total. I'm going to keep going. No shotgun blasts on me yet. There's one. I got two brains. <laughs> Five. Seven. I'm going to keep going. No, I better stop. I, I, I better stop. I'm going to stop with seven brains and pass it. Thirteen wins. Steve and Kyle. I've seen a 13 brain run before. A guy taking the cup and got 13 in a row. How many? Seven. Wow. You ain't got it today. Okay. You ain't got it. Oh my God. There's gosh. one blast. Boom. <gasps> one wow. brain, one blast. Okay, I stop. She's going to stop with only one. One. Nope. I'm up. Here we go. Seven. Boom. Two brains, one blast. It's your day. Boom. I'll stop. There's two blasts. I'm going to stop with three brains. Okay. Bring me to a total of how many? You have ten. Ten. Thirteen wins. Yeah. Two, two brains. No, <laughs> A blast and two footsteps. I know. There's three blasts. She's out. I'm going for the game here. Remember, you begin. There's a brain and a blast. I'll keep going. And one footstep, making three. Boom. Another brain has two blasts. I'll stop with two. Oh my God. One more you win. One more I win. It's my day. <laughs> you ain't got it. Two brains and a blast. A 
Ooh, two more. Two. Total of four out there. Ah, it's possible. Two. Mm, five. I stop. She stops with five. How many I need? Just uh, one? Yeah. I, you have you have twelve. One, one wins me the game. <gasps> Boom! Uh. Oh! <laughs> two blasts. I gotta go for it. I gotta go for it. Boom! Three blasts. I'm out. She's got another shot. Oh! Three brains. Three brains. It's very good. Oh, two more. <laughs> Boom! It's all over. You lose know five. <laughs> this is it! This is it! One brain. Oh. Two blasts, I'll stop there. I win. I win. Congratulations. It's all on the wrist, how you throw it. It's all on the wrist. <laughs> uh. Zombie Dice, Steve Jackson Games. I remember Steve Jackson Games early in my gaming career back in a uh, local bookstore. They had Ogre, they had uh, Hacker, they had uh, Car Wars, you remember those games, and this is an, a big winner for Steve Jackson games. It's simple, but so what? So what? Is it, you're gonna get a lot more play out of this than one of those big games you get uh, that has a rule book, you know, this thick. Because, you know, not only can gamers enjoy this, it's also uh, anybody, no setup, you pull it out, you play it, and it, and it works great. Um, filler, it's filler, sure, but filler is killer. Remember my saying, filler is killer. Um, it just, uh, I got a couple ideas for you on this. Number, uh, you notice we were keeping score on, uh, with pencil and paper. You can also use poker chips, it's a lot easier. Uh, but a, a better idea I had, you, you see these little um, brains, these pencil eraser brains you can use to keep score, which would make this game uh, up, up the quality of the game. Also, when you're playing for money, uh, the, use a backgammon doubling cube. That will up the tension in the game greatly, and it, it makes it a lot of fun when you're playing for money. Say you're down six brains, down seven brains, and the guy doubles, pushes you, do you accept or quit right there? Makes it a lot of fun. I recommend Zombie Dice a lot, but like I said, it's not important what I think. It's what Caro thinks. Let's check the Maraca meter. <laughs>